Hello everyone and thank you for taking the time to um, watch this short clip about my role in the Academy as Assistant Head Teacher for Personal Development. So my name is Katrina Temple uh, and I'm just going to talk you through some of the really fun stuff that we do at the Academy to help develop your children along the way with their five years that they spend with us. So here at City Academy we are committed to the development of all our students and that's imperative and we want every student to be called what we call a game changer. And so what I wanted to do in this short video is just talk through what we mean by being a, a game changer and what that looks like and how they develop through the five years that your child might be here with us at City Academy. So it's to be kind, to have that unconditional positive regard to be confident and resilient, to be happy and independent in their learning. And what we really would like is to those children who leave us to make the world a better tomorrow than it is today. And we have every belief in our students to do that. So how do we develop these game changers? Well, we do it through what's called can character. So we have our era, enjoy, respect, achieve, and we have our game changers for students to gain house points so that they can um, learn to um, be better model, role models with better role models in terms of what they're doing and to reward some really good stuff that they're doing. So with that we have top 100 celebrations and last year we had the pleasure of having some bouncy castle um, and some assault course activities as you can see on there. So being in the top, top 100 means that they are earning and achieving house points for themselves and for their team in the term, receiving less than behave 50 behaviour points and getting that celebration t-shirt so that they could use that to celebrate for the event. Some really great stuff last year as you can see and the children had a fantastic time. We also put every child that comes into the academy into a house and so we are very aligned with our school values of enjoy, respect, achieve and we hold regular inter-house competitions throughout the year such as science fairs, um, ready steady cook day, sports day and much much more and we're developing that as we go along over the year. So, like I said, each house your child will be assigned to, they will either be a Griffin, a Phoenix or a Titans and we work together as a team to be able to lift that house cup at the end in a whole school assembly. What we also believe is for our University of City Academy, our UCAN um, information, is that we have this vision to provide a broad and ever-changing enrichment curriculum that offers a variety of opportunities for all to enjoy and achieve. So on a Thursday we have UCAN where the year seven and eight students have the opportunity to take part in a plethora of activities from horse riding to skiing and that's just a few of the activities that we have done over the last couple of years. Um, at the moment we are a little bit restricted and I'll talk about what we're doing at the moment to meet those needs and demands of our children. And as you can see in the picture, our head teacher, Mr. Colin, is with our scholars, um, those that graduated from the class of 2019. So that going from year seven into year eight, we put that language into their learning so that they can be the best versions of themselves. So here are, like I've said, some of the fantastic opportunities that some of our students in year seven and eight got to take part in last year. So how do we also develop game changers? Well, in the light of COVID, we're not able to do some of those activities at the moment, but we are hoping that they will be up and coming soon. What we do have is the game changers website where there are weekly challenges set by our teachers in school by different departments and children can have a look, take part, and then log their progress on the Google doc for them to have a little look at some fantastic opportunities such as physical activities, outdoor activities and some weekly challenges set by the teachers such as cooking. We also have for our year 10s the Duke of Edinburgh Award that they take part in every Thursday when we are able to um, and they can work towards their bronze award in school so that they can develop their physical and their volunteering um, parts of that um, to be a real game changer which the year 10s have really thoroughly embraced and enjoyed. 
We also have the student council in which students can take part to share their views and air their and be their voice for the student body and again we have student ambassadors representing our schools to meet local MPs to discuss things like policies and help organise charity days and help us in and around the school with badges and celebration certificates. We also have, like I've said, for our charities, um, we've worked really, really hard over the last few years to gain donations for our charities. And last year we raised £1,795.86 um, for one alone during Remembrance Sunday, Christmas Jumper Day, Children in Need. And our children really embrace that and are really keen to take part. So, also, in terms of being a game changer, weekly informed time, we have the developing eight personal skills for our students. We really want them to be good listeners, good speakers, work as part of a team, and be able to show high leadership so that they can become scholars and they can become the best versions of themselves. And that's delivered through a skills builder programme, informed time, to get them confident and resilient young learners. We also, within the curriculum, have PSHE, p for c and PBV. PSHE is what they do in form time, so too is p for c philosophy for children, which they can take part in oracy skills to discuss topics that are relevant to society at the, this current moment. So we also have, in tutor time, embracing the well-being of our students, Mindfulness Monday, Thoughtful Friday, Physical Friday, Wellness Wednesday, to be able to really develop those strong characteristics and those skills of our students. In p for c we really encourage them to take part, work together, and to develop their oracy skills so that they can portray themselves in a positive way and explore the world around them and deal with challenging and difficult situations and ask questions about them. PBV sorry, is also something that is prevalent within our curriculum in which we embrace all of those things in terms of looking at PSHE, looking at religion and looking at different cultures and beliefs so that again our students can broaden their horizons and really be the best people that they can be. It's part of the statutory um, setting that we have here at the Academy and in all schools and um, it's taught throughout the year groups to help them develop healthy relationships also. We also have PC Campbell who is our Safer Schools Officer based at the school and she helps with a plethora of issues that we may have in the school. She is always at hand for our students and our staff and our parents, whether um, it is a small question or something larger, she is always at, on hand to give us a hand, which is absolutely fantastic, a brilliant support mechanism within the school. Finally, I'd just like to talk about um, a final bit of our game changer um, mantra, which is the you can be a. We strongly and firmly believe that every child deserves the same chance and so we promote careers very much in the form time structure. The you can be a structure so that from year 7 through to year 11 they get to develop as students and get to learn about the world around them and be proactive in terms of their applications for when they leave school so that they are confident, they are resilient, they are happy and they are able to know exactly what they want and the qualifications that they'll need to be able to get them there. So the You Can Be a Dedicated Careers programme helps to raise the aspirations of our children, challenge the stereotyping and promote equality and diversity. So that wraps up personal development at City Academy. Um, it's broad, it's balanced, it's fun, it's exciting and it really is about developing the children here. If you do have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask me. I would be happy to discuss further. Thank you for watching.